What's the best way to build responsive UI? Material UI or Tailwind CSS? Let's have a look. I'll be comparing these two in terms of customization, ease of use, performance, and speed. So if we talk about customization in this area, Tailwind CSS wins because Tailwind CSS works more like CSS where you can design the layout as you want using all the predefined classes in Tailwind CSS. Whereas Material UI has pre-built components which are much more harder to customize. Even though Material UI gives some kind of flexibility to build a theme and customize all the components, but there is going to be a lot of learning curve to build a theme and it's not that user friendly how the customization in Material UI works. So Tailwind CSS CSS is a clear winner in this area. Which one is easier to use? I think if you are starting out, Material UI is much easier to use because you can just install it and use all the components that are available in Material UI. Whereas Tailwind CSS, you have to learn about predefined classes first. You need to have very good knowledge on how to make components responsive. Whereas in Material UI, all the components are already responsive and usable directly in the application. So I believe Material UI is much easier to start using than Tailwind CSS. Tailwind CSS has a bit of learning curve in initially to learn about all the classes and responsiveness. So Material UI is the winner in this area. Let me know in the comments what do you think. If we talk about performance of the application that has been built with Tailwind CSS, I think it's going to be much better than the app that has been built with Material UI because Tailwind CSS has an inbuilt feature where it purge all the unused CSS in the project. Whereas Material UI comes with a lot of overload of pre-built components, which are harder to control. So Tailwind CSS will be much more faster in terms of loading speed and performance of the app. It's not to say that Material UI is bad in terms of speed, but there are a lot of factors go into when we try to do the SEO for the project. You have to worry about a lot of factors which are harder to control with Material UI. So in short, Tailwind CSS is definitely the winner in this area and if i'm building an app that needs to have premium level of performance in terms of speed and design i'll definitely go with tailwind css when i talk about speed i mean to say not the speed of the app but the speed at which you'll be able to build the entire app if you're using tailwind css or material ui so in this case what i think is if you're using material ui you'll be able to build an app much faster than tailwind css because with material ui there are a lot of pre-built components and you don't have to worry about responsiveness of each and every component and you don't have to style these components because they are already kind of styled in a good way but if you're using tailwind css then the speed at which you can build an app is going to be much slower because you have to worry about the design and responsiveness even though there are a lot of predefined classes in Tailwind CSS which help to make the design responsive but still Material UI is definitely going to be faster in this area. So now that we have discussed all the factors my recommendation on this one is if you are building a project and you want to build it faster probably you can't spend too much time based on the budget of the project. In that case you have to go with material UI or if you are building something as a minimum viable product in that case try using material UI to build that project it's going to be much faster but if you are building something where performance and accuracy of the design is going to be the key and you have a provision to spend long time on the project in that case go with Tailwind CSS if you found a value in this information that I've shared in this video do subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one